What's going on everybody? You got the Raging Rob here. Uh, Walmart has just been their fucking butts over for David Hogg's Communist Party. Uh, David Hogg Nazi and Emma Gonzalez Nazi and the rest of the fucking Nazis at the March for Our Lives uh, Communist Party have threatened Walmart into slavery enough where they bend their fucking ass cheeks over and now David Hogg is fucking them in the ass with this fucking dildo. Um, basically what happened was, now it's not totally bad, because Walmart isn't, here's what's going on, okay, let me get, let me get to the point of the ass fucking that David Hogg is bending over Walmart and doing. I don't know why people want to bend over for this little faggot. I don't know why CEOs ain't got a fucking backbone. But here's what's going on. It's not totally as bad as it seems. Walmart is now stopping the sale of handgun ammunition. And all its stores, let me rephrase that, handgun ammunition. They're gonna still sell shotguns, they're gonna still sell rifles, sporting rifles, not assault rifles. Um, and ammunition for that, They they're not going to allow open carry in their Walmarts anymore. They're going to allow concealed carry if you have a concealed carry permit. So I'm good. I have a concealed carry permit in two states. And I always conceal carry anyway. So, and I always conceal carry anyway when I go inside Walmart. So I'm good. I don't, I, I did buy handgun ammunition at Walmart uh, uh, quite a few times. So I just have to go to the gun stores now. It's not a big deal. So I just have to bend over. I, I have to bend over a little bit for David Hawk. Okay. Because, you know, that's what he's doing now. So. Ugh, there you go. Because that's what he's doing to gun owners now. That shop at Walmart for the kind gun ammunition. You know. So anyway, um. Nobody has a fucking backbone anymore. Uh, we're letting these kids, kids, run our country. There was a part in 1791, no, yeah, in 1791, when the Second Amendment was written, there's a little part, you know, you know, like when you go to a store or, or, you, or you order something online and there's that little little uh, letters in writing that says this, you know, that says something in case, you know, whatever, when you buy a product, it has that little letters in writing, if or whatever. Well, when the Second Amendment was written in 1791, there was a little bit of writing at the bottom that said, now, in case, and in that, and that, and that, and that lighting, and that, and that lettering said this. However, this amendment is going to be amended if little kids from South Florida are going to start crying their eyes out on TV because they didn't get their way. <laughs> you know? That's what it said in 1791. Our forefathers were smart. So now that the kids have gotten their way, we're going to, you know, bend over for them. David Hogg's a fucking beast. I got to give him credit, man. He, la he he lets, I don't know how he does it, but he's got fucking CEOs of fucking multi-billion dollar companies dancing for him on strings. That, David Hogg is a fucking biblical beast puppet master at its finest. This guy has got the fucking country dancing on strings. He's got the state of Florida dancing on strings for him. He's got CEOs dancing on strings. He has political politicians dancing on strings. David Hogg is a fucking beast. A biblical powers. How does he do it? I can't pull this shit off. Superman can't pull this fucking shit off. Batman can't pull this shit off. 
Aquaman. Uh, Robert Downey Jr. What's that guy? Iron Man. How does David Hawk do it? This guy is more biblical than Alpha Omega. How does he do it? I wish I had the powers he has. Oh my God. That's what's going to happen. And, and, uh, the only Walmart, the only state that Walmart sells handguns, Alaska, uh, Alaska is now going to stop selling handguns in Walmart. So he has officially made somebody, made a store way up in the frontier of Alaska dance on his strings. That's fucking biblical. David Hogg is a fucking biblical beast. Puppet master. Bigger than El Presidor. People say he should start lifting weights. He doesn't have to. He's got biblical fucking powers. He just opens his mouth and runs his mouth and runs his damn fingers on Twitter and people dance for him and bend over for him. And it's the organization. Crazy. Anyway, that's what's going on at Walmart. I'm out.